All Nation Skate Jam sample. We just did the DEFCON Skate High Notchbacks. The pros. Always nice to get these syndicate newspapers. And now out of the DEFCON pack we're going to do the Old School Pro S. Slightly different color. Here we go to a black and a green as opposed to the brown, more of the desert brown. These are slightly different. We have the DEFCON right there and we have the patch on the top of the tongue. A military feel on these all the way around. So we have all kinds of people chasing these shoes. And I'm very glad that I doubled up. I'm anxious to get that new camera in. Soon, upgrading a lot of different things. Some of the details here on that canvas. More of a green rather than the brown. And you notice this one here does not have a jazz stripe per se. We have the threads giving us the detail, but the overall stripe is not there. They both come with these rope style laces as a second. The all black is a little bit more difficult to see than the lighter browns. They ship with a regular style lace. There you can see the black one. And I prefer in my pairs these ropes. Most definitely all the way for me with that. That's how I will definitely rock mine. The soles, important to mention, is that winter type of a sole. It's a, like a reverse waffle. So you've got more like little uh, prongs or pods like a boot style. So you can be firmer of foot out where these are intended to be. More of a field style shoe as opposed to a board shoe. In my opinion, that always seems to excite people when I say things like that and they want to disagree or tell me why I'm an idiot and those kind of things and don't know anything about vans and it's always fun. Funny and fun. I remember when the factory opened in 1966. I was in California at the time and for the first uh, couple of years or so you could basically bring materials in and the guys would do whatever you wanted to. Only a couple of styles of shoes but it was a whole lot of fun. So as far as uh, IDs, 101s and the rest, Vans kind of started some of that stuff. It didn't just start with those black and white slip-ons made famous by Spicoli in Fast Times. It was a long time after folks. Anxious to see what continues to build up as we get closer and closer to the 50th anniversary of Vans. Great shoes. The old style packaging. They're not the boxes that I like. Nevertheless, I put my shoes into a plastic tub when I wear them anyway. So it's no real big deal. These can be said, well, we're taking you back to the originals. When we had these style back boxes, same time we can look at them being fairly cheap. Oh well, life goes on as long as the shoes continue to scream. The boxes are kind of hard to complain about. At least long term. Find me here, as usual, all my different places, also on Google+. And as you all know, I am downsizing some of the collection. I'll continue to add shoes over time to goodshoes.com. Spent a lot of time today cleaning up the uh, site, hopefully making it easier to use, easier to navigate, and a lot more user-friendly with all of the clutter gone. Very happy that I got my DEF CONs and very happy I've got that second pair secured Good luck finding them. I hope everybody that wants them does. They are great shoes. 
and I hope they make enough for all of us.